Yo, what's going guys? Well, I'll be back with another video and today I'm going to be showing you an updated version on how to boost your FPS on, in Roblox using Blockstrap. My last video, it was pretty rushed to be honest. So I'm creating a new one for you guys. So, Alright, so the first thing you're going to want to do, obviously download Blockstrap. I'll leave the link in the description below. But um, first thing you're going to want to do, open up your Chrome, search up Blockstrap and then over here. Then go down to Blockstrap and download it. Once you're done downloading it, um, you can open it up. Mine's gonna be right here. You're gonna open up the Blockstrap menu right over here. This is what you're gonna see. And obviously, um, there's gonna be a lot of stuff that you can do. This part is just personal preference. I kind of like it. So like, um, enable activity tracking, which means on Discord if it shows, it will show e exactly what game you're playing. Say I'm playing Blockstrap. It's gonna show. I'm playing blocks which is gonna show up pretty sure how many people are in the game I I'm not a hundred percent sure but um I like having this on um anyways uh next is gonna go mods mod is like where you can change up the appearance of how your Roblox in game looks so you can use the odd death sound so when you resell if you die you're gonna hear the odd oof so then um the mouse curse you can have the old mouse curse instead of the new disgusting one I put the 2013 it's kind of good you can use the old avatar background or the emulate old character sounds this is all personal preference i like to disable the d desktop app because it's kind of annoying every time i turn off the game it just pops up out of nowhere and i hate it you can turn that off if you want to and um disable full screen optimization uh, optimizations is good because um it improves in performance next thing you're gonna want to go on is fast flags so before we go to the fast flag editor we're gonna want to look at the presets so at the frame rate limit, I recommend putting it at 9999 to make it so you have unlimited FPS so you're not capped at some sort of FPS. And for the lighting technology, I recommend Voxel Phase 1. And then for the prefer preferred um, escape menu and you know, all the rest, is just personal preference. Um, I put mine at version 1 so it looks like the OG Roblox escape menu. And I'm pretty sure um, you should um, keep these off because like, there's really no point of them. But if you want to turn them on, and I'm pretty sure you have to turn off this and or textures for the fast flags i might be wrong so once you go on to fast flags i'm going to keep the description below but um i have this uh notepad right here so uh over here is going to have all the it's going to have the um json so what you're going to want to do this could be in the description so i'm going to control a i'm going to copy it and then i'm going to go import json and i'm going to paste it in here and then i'm going to click ok as you can see it's already here and then you can paste it in one thing i would change about it is the debug display fps i'll turn this off if you don't want like an annoying random fps dis fps display at the top or something um if you do want that then you can keep it off other than that that is going to be it for this then if you want to when you're gonna want to save it just click save after that that is basically it that's basically it for the video that's all of the new stuff i showed you guys is basically just fast flags so what that does is basically it just made your roblox improve better like improve fps without any like visual changes and it made it and it made it so you can um load roblox textures faster than it usually does so it adds a new loading texture thing and it doesn't use a regular default roblox one because that one takes like forever and it gets really annoying sometimes so uh that is going to be for the video i hope you enjoyed i hope this helped a lot if you have any questions, put them in the comments. Um, yeah, peace out and goodbye.